Hello there. Okay, so you're looking for a new TV show, but not just any TV show. You need it to have heavy video game vibes, and that's okay. Make yourself comfy and take a look at our propositions for the top 10 TV shows based on video games. Number one, do you wanna be the very best like no one ever was? Yes, we're talking about Pokemon. You can argue which is most popular, the TV show or the video game series, but one thing's for sure, Pokemon is one of the biggest franchises in the world. It all started with the release of Pokemon Red and Blue on the classic Game Boy, and then followed with the show which has aired over 1,000 episodes by now. If you haven't watched this classic series featuring the most famous trainer of all time, Ash Ketchum, well, there's quite a lot of catching up to do. Number 2. The Witcher the Witcher 3 video game was a huge success, and still is CD Projekt's biggest release up to date, cause you know, Cyberpunk wasn't all that great. But anyway, in December 2019, The Witcher 3 show debuted on Netflix, starring Henry Cavill as your boy Geralt. Then came the second season, and we can certainly say that the show is a must-watch for every fan of The Butcher of Blaviken. Watch it and try to count how many times Henry says f and hmm. Number 3. Arcane Do you like League of Legends? If so, you have to watch Arcane. This action-adventure Netflix series focuses mainly on V, voiced by Haley Steinfeld, and Jinx, Ella Purnell, but features many more characters from Riot's MOBA. Arcane immediately became a huge hit. No wonder, the story is top-notch and as you can see, the animation is simply gorgeous. All we have to do now is wait for the second season, which is expected to show up in 2023 or even later. Number 4. Castlevania Castlevania is a long-running video game series which debuted back in 1986 on NES. Since then, the game appeared on almost every possible gaming system, and as it developed, it defined the popular Metroidvania genre. Anyway, the games were never super focused on the story, and it's really a great experience to watch the full four seasons featuring the adventures of Belmond, Alucard, Sifa, and other characters from the franchise. Number 5. The Cuphead Show Love Cuphead for its aesthetics and overall vibe, but the levels and boss fights made you frustrated beyond belief. No worries. With The Cuphead Show, all you gotta do is sit and watch. You can find the adventures of Cuphead and his bro, Mugman, on Netflix. And what's interesting, unlike the game, the TV series is kid-friendly. That's right, it's a perfect show to watch with your family on a Sunday afternoon. Number 6. Dota – Dragon's Blood Oh look, another MOBA with animated adaptation. While it doesn't look as good as Arcane, it's still a very solid series and a must-watch for all fans of one of Valve's most popular games. A little warning though, the show is gory as hell. There's rivers of blood, decapitated heads flying all over the place, and a whole lot of gruesome imagery. This one won't do for a Sunday afternoon. Number 7. Alien Isolation – The Digital Series Yes, I know, it all started with a movie, which is a classic by the way, and you should definitely watch it. But in this case, we're talking about a series that is a follow-up to a particular game. And if you've enjoyed your time with Alien Isolation, there's no good reason not to watch it. The series is quite short, it's just 7 episodes, each one around 10 minutes long, and gives you a chance to revisit Amanda's story from a little different angle. Number 8. Halo The Series Will Master Chief save humanity once again? Well, guess you gotta watch the show to find out. Halo the series is based on a long-running and very popular, especially among the Xbox players, FPS franchise. In a few words, the show's about the war between United Nations Space Command and the Covenant, a hostile alliance of aliens who want to, you guessed it, destroy the human race. Jokes aside though, it's a very good sci-fi show, which you should watch even if you don't care about the video game. Number 9. Tekken Bloodline at the time of making this video, Tekken Bloodline is not out yet, but oh boy, we're so excited about this show. This anime, based on one of the best fighting series of all time, tells an original story set between Tekken 2 and 3 and focuses mainly on Jin Kazama. As you can see, it looks gorgeous and features many iconic characters, and what's even better, also their signature moves and combos. Don't miss out on this new Netflix show. Number 10. It's a me, Mario. That's right, we've reserved the very last entry for the absolute classic, The Super Mario Bros. Super Show. This mix of live action and animation was first aired back in 1989. 
Yep, ages ago. But it still holds up pretty well and is a must-watch for all Mario fans. And who doesn't like Mario, right? You don't have to watch it all. It's a pretty long series, but make sure to go through at least a couple of episodes to experience the unique atmosphere of the show. And that's it. That's the end of the list. How'd you like it? Are there any good shows that we've missed? If so, don't be shy, drop us a comment. Thanks a lot for watching this, and see you next time.